Hello everybody, welcome to another video of snare and bait. As you can tell, it's pretty windy out here. Um, I'm going to be going to a place, it's called Maxwell Game Preserve. At this place, there's they've got rocks and they've got all kinds of stuff. they got all kinds of fish over there. And I'm going to be throwing a jerk bait and i also got something special. Um, I'll tell you guys about it later, but I can't wait to see what I can catch on it. But um, at this place, I'm going to be going to the dam. There's some rocks and it's going to be wind blown. And I'm just going to see what I can do over there. So I'll catch you guys over there in a bit. Alright guys, I'm just going to go over my arsenal of what I'll be using. Um, right now I just got this uh, bait caster. It's an Abu Garcia. Um, what I got rigged up is a Livingston crankbait on my next rod. It's a spinning rod. It's uh, President 6930. Um, it's got, I think it's 8 pound line on it. I uh, just got rigged up as a drop shot rig. Um, my next pole here, um, I've had this pole for a long time, but I've just kept it around just because so, it's easy to use and it's really short so I can get it where I want it to be. Uh, what I got rigged up on that is a Mimic Minnow by Northerland Tackle. And um, I got something special for you guys. I found a cockroach today and I'm going to see if I can either catch a bass on it or maybe I can catch, I don't know, like a catfish or something, but I'm just going to see what I can do about that and I'll catch you guys over at that lake. made it to this fishing spot over here um, as you can see uh, it's really pretty windy over here but what I brought with me is just this crankbait and I just got a hook and a weight on it to see if I can catch anything on this little cockroach here so I'm gonna walk up here on top of the dam and find a good spot first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this cockroach out of the little thing here and I'm gonna toss it out there all right everybody I'm just gonna hook up this cockroach I'm thinking I'm just gonna go right through it maybe a couple times just something like that and just cast it out there and see what I can get I'm gonna set this one up here and then I'm gonna uh, get my bait casting reel here and just see what I can do. There's one. I just caught one. I don't know what it is yet, but I hooked into something pretty good here. I hooked into a catfish.
Not quite what we're looking for, but it sure was a nice catch though. All right guys, there's that channel cat. It's not a bad catch there, but I'm gonna let it go and see if I can actually catch a bass off that crankbait. There it goes. All right guys, I switched it up a little bit and I put a jerk bait on here. And I'm gonna go to this side a little bit and throw a parallel to these rocks and see if any bass are waiting over here. Alright guys, I'm going to just check this cockroach pole and see if there's anything on it. Ah. Well. There goes that cockroach idea. It was worth a, sh worth a shot, but we'll see if I can try something else different next time. Uh, I'm gonna go put on a crankbait back on this other pole and I'll catch you guys back over here. All right guys, I didn't have very much luck over on this dam over here. Uh, I'm gonna walk over here, um, kind of along this ridge and kind of in that little pocket where that's not so much current. Uh, I'm going to try that out a little bit and hopefully I don't run out of sunlight. If I do, I should, still had a great time fishing out here and I appreciate all you guys watching my videos. Uh, if there's anything you see that I can improve on, I know I say it a lot, but I really just like making these videos for you guys and I just really like recording my adventures. And There's one. Oh, I gotta just be careful not to break this line or make him mad or anything. That's a nice bass. Oh, wow, that's not a bass. Oh my goodness. It's a nice channel cat though. Look at that guys. That's awesome. All right guys, here's that catfish I caught on that crankbait. Uh, today's just kind of a weird day. I caught two channel cat on crankbaits. Um, I don't think that's really a rare sign. I think they just kind of just go after those two because they think it's bait fish and this one's kind of been eaten too. So I'm gonna put a release on this one. It's a really nice size one. It's a keepable size, but I'm just gonna let it go. So let's get a good release on it and let that thing go. All right, everybody, uh, I did a little bit of fishing here. I didn't have very much luck, but I still had a great time, uh, especially when I get to look at that at the very end of it. Um, I like to thank all of you guys for watching. I had a great time. Uh, some of the things I learned is, uh, I don't know, just fishing a crankbait just along the ridges, kind of along there, and different things like that, and jerkbait. Um, it's not always easy. Um, sometimes you just don't catch fish. Other times you do. Uh, I like to thank all you guys for watching, and I hope you have a great day.